can win $32,000 on the tournament photo card on Now my next episode of Card Sharks, Big John for the PC. And if you notice, Aubrey is the new champion with $32,200 because he ran the money cards last time and he has chosen to take on Jaguars Fan 2012, now known as Muhammad okay, Number One Fan. Okay, let's play, play some Card Sharks, boy. Aubrey won the yeah. money. Aubrey ran the money cards the last episode. He did. Yeah. Oh, well, good for you, Aubrey. Thank you. And of course, and it's and you all know how to play. So, without any further delay, why don't we start? And Aubrey, good. and first question always goes to the champion, and in this case, it's Aubrey. And yeah. this is a this is a trivia question, Aubrey. What percentage of the time does the doctor lose his case in a court of law? Uh, 30%. Thinks it's, Aubrey says 30% of the time the doctor loses the case in a court of law. Mikey, do you think that's higher or lower than 30%? Well, after what happened with Michael Jackson, I think it's going to be higher. Going higher. If it is higher, Mikey will play his cards. Aubrey, if it's 30 or lower, you will play yours. The actual percentage of the time that doctors lose their case in a court of law is... Oh! Whoa! Wait, wait, did Aubrey hit it on the nose? He did! Oh! $500 oh. bonus. Aubrey, your base card is an 8. 7 plus 1. Get rid of it. Changing that eight when you win the question, you can change the quest. You can change the base card. It's an ace. All right, let's go lower. Lower than an ace, it is a ten. Oh. What? Oh, okay. Lower than a ten, it is a six. Freezing on the six, not giving Mikey a chance at the cards. Nope. And My and Aubrey needs only two cards for the first game. And, and uh, Mikey, the next question is to you, and this is another trivia question. What is the fastest time in seconds that a horse has run a mile? Probably about um, 40 seconds. 40 seconds. Aubrey, or uh, Mikey says the fastest time that a horse has run a mile is 40 seconds. Uh, Aubrey, higher or lower than 40 seconds? Go lower. Go lower. The actual amount of time in seconds it took for a horse to run a mile is... 92! Oh. Wow, that is without a doubt the, probably the slowest horse, or perhaps a mile is a lot longer than you think it is. Mikey, your base card is a 4. Higher. Higher than a 4? It is a 9. Taking a chance. Lower than a nine, it is a seven. All three. Freezing on the seven, not giving Aubrey a chance at the cards. And Aubrey, the next question is to you. Oh god, oh gosh. Here we go, oh, here we go. Aubrey, we asked 100 bachelors. Would you dress up as a woman and date a man for $10,000? How many of these bachelors said they would dress up as a woman and date a man for $10,000? What the hell? <laughs> I'm guessing. <laughs> it's to 100 bachelors, Mark. Yeah, but women are mentioned in the question, so... I wouldn't even do it for a million dollars. I'm going to say that's a low number. I'm going to say that. Ten of them would. Ten of a hundred bachelors said they would dress up as a woman and date a man for ten thousand dollars. Mikey, higher or lower than ten? I've got some stories, but I'll save them for, for another time. But I think it's going to be higher. Go on higher. The actual number of these bachelors would dress up as a woman and date a man for ten thousand dollars is... Fifty-four! It is higher! And Matt, just for the record, I would never do that. Not even if I was offered a million bucks. Not even 
billion of that. Uh, uh, Mikey, you have a seven. You have the seven. Change that card. Change in the seven. When you win the question, you can change the base card. It's a queen. Oh, the on. I'm sorry? Lower. Lower than a queen? It is an eight. Seven plus one. Freeze on the eight. Freeze on the eight. Not giving Aubrey a chance. This is the fourth and final question. Someone must win on this play of the cards. And Mikey, the question goes to you. Mikey, we asked 100 New York fashion models. Is it important to you that the man or woman you date be good looking? How many of these 100 New York fashion models said, yes, it is important to them that the man or woman they date be good looking? Well, a lot of, you know, ladies, and, you know, ladies don't look at what is in a guy's heart, not by the looks anymore. Not to say 36. 36 of 100 New York fashion models said it is important to them that the man or woman they date be good looking. Aubrey, higher or lower than 36? I'll go higher. Going higher. The astral number of these New York fashion models said it is important that the man or woman they date be good looking is 60. It is higher. Yeah. Wow. Okay, now here's the situation. Aubrey, you won the question. You have a base card of a six. You can change it if you wish. Or you need two cards of the championship. Mikey needs only one, but he has a base card of an eight for seven plus one. And he only needs one card. Aubrey, you have a base card of a six, but you won the question, so you can change it if you want. What do you want to do? I think I'll change the six. All right. He wants to change the six, and it is a ten. Okay, lower. One goof, Mikey wins. Lower than a 10, it is a 4. Higher! For the game, higher, it is a 5. Yes. Good job. Good job. Aubrey wins game number 1. Mikey, this is make or break for you. <laughs> Five cards I'm each. And the I'm still laughing at that bachelor question. And uh, Aubrey, the next question is to you. And the game is thinking of a number between zero and a hundred. Oh God, I had one of those in my match between Corey and Nick earlier today. Before I give you my answer, you're gonna have to give me a 30-minute window. I just farted. <sighs> okay, now that that's out of the way, I'll give you my answer. 25. Aubrey thinks the number between 0 and 100 is 25. Mikey, higher or lower? Who knows what the computer fa is thinking? I'll say higher. Go on higher. The actual number, of no the actual number between 0 and 100 that the game is thinking of is... 45! It is higher! <laughs> Mikey, your base card is a 4! Higher! Higher than a 4? It is a 10! Lower! Lower than a 10? It is a four. Oh. Higher. Higher than a four. It is an ace. Oh. Lower. For the second game, lower. Yes, a five. Oh. And, Aub and Mikey has tied it up. We are going to our third game, which only three cards will be dealt out. And the next question goes to Mikey. Mikey, we asked 100 men who are married for over 50 years. Who are married 50 years, I should say. Mikey, we asked 100 men married 50 years, and we asked them, was the first year the hardest? How many of these 150-year married men, men of 50 years married or more, said that, yes, the first year was the hardest? Well, I've never been married in my life, so I have to say 57. 57 of 100 married men of, who are men married 50 years said the first year was the hardest. Uh, Aubrey, higher or lower than 57? Going lower. Going lower. The actual number of these married men of 50 years or more who said that the first year was the hardest is 40. It is hot. It is lower. Aubrey, your base card is a four. I'll keep it higher. Higher than a four. Oh no, another four. Mikey, your base card is a six. You have to play at the six. You did not win the question. Higher. Higher than a six? It is a ten. I'm going to gamble and go lower here. For the championship, lower. Oh, no, a king. Oh. Aubrey, we asked 100 people in Omaha, Nebraska, and we asked them, 
Did you get up before sunrise this morning? How many of these hundred people in Omaha, Nebraska said that they did get up before... Apologize about that guy. Camera shut off on me. And Aubrey gave his answer of a 50. Am I right on that? That's right. Okay, 50 of 100 people in Omaha, Nebraska said they got up before sunrise this morning. Mikey, higher or lower than 50? Uh, lower. Going lower. Lower. The actual number of these people in Omaha, Nebraska got up before sunrise this morning is... 59, it is higher, not lower. Aubrey, you have that four. Higher. Higher than a four? It is a seven. Higher. Taking a chance for the second game in championship? Yes, a ten. Good job, Aubrey. Aubrey has won two games. Thank you. play the money cards. He has two hundred dollars plus a five hundred dollar bonus, so that's seven hundred dollars. And here we are at the money cards with Aubrey S. 1987 once again. And this time, and if you saw what happened last time, he ran the money cards, winning thirty-two thousand dollars plus two hundred from the game. And of course. Aubrey will start, we'll start you at the bottom row with $200 of betting money. You bet way across three cards. Move you to the second row. Give you another $400 of betting money. Where you bet way across another three cards. $50 of minimum bet. You get to the, to the top card, the big bet, where you must risk at least half the money. And if you double-double all the way, that's $32,000 like you did last time. And let's hope you can do it again. Here's $200. And a reminder, if you, and a reminder, if the same card pops up, it is a, it is a push, meaning you do not win and you don't lose, and if, and you can change the base card one time per line. For two hundred dollars, Aubrey, you start off with a jack. Okay, I'll bet the whole two hundred that it's lower. Okay, two hundred dollars lower than a jack. It is an eight. Seven plus one. You have four hundred dollars and an eight. Four hundred dollars and an eight. Change it with number three. All right. Let's see if you make a good change. The eight becomes a seven. Okay. All right. Well, you know what? I'm going to take a huge risk and go all of it higher. Betting it all. $400. Higher than a seven? It is an ace. $800 and an ace. All right. All the bumpers. Come on, for sixteen hundred, yes, the jack. You clear the board on the bottom level. Four dollars more, you have two thousand dollars and a jack. All right. What's it gonna be? The whole two thousand dollars, all of it lower. Two thousand dollars lower than a jack. It is a six. Four thousand dollars and a six. Okay. I'd like to change that with number one. All right, let's see if you can make a good change. The six becomes. A queen! All right, all of it lower. Come on, for $8,000. Lower than a queen, it is a four. $8,000 and a four. All the higher. $8,000 higher than a four? Oh no, it's a three. Oh, Aubrey, unbelievable. I thought you could do no wrong. Oh. The, the, the eight cards that could have beaten it, and man, one of them had to come up. No. Oh. oh, well. Well, at least yeah. you can redeem yourself with a jackpot of a $20,000 jackpot, I should say. One through seven. You have only one shot. Number two. All right. Is the dollar sign behind two? It is! another $20,000. Good job, Aubrey. And it says he has $52,400, so we have a $500 bonus for him, so he has $52,900. And we'll see you all for the next episode. See you soon, folks.